Hello everyone, I'm the guy in the basement, Drunk Farmer. That's the basement. And today we're going to talk about the Super Bowl commercials and the Super Bowl halftime. Now let's begin with the Super Bowl commercials. Yeah. Um, yeah. Hit and miss again, once again this year. They kind of hit and miss. Uh, some of the commercials, I just kind of went, what, what? Other commercials were just, I found boring. Um, there's a couple of commercials here and there that were good. Um, I think the big commercial that everybody was kind of talking about with the Bruce, Spring, Bruce Springsteen Jeep commercial. I, I trying to show unity or something. I didn't really get it, but you know, I think Bruce Springsteen should just stick to rock and roll and write his music because that's how he gets his point across is through his music. Doing a Jeep commercial. No, not so much. I mean, granted, Bruce Springsteen is a great guy. He's, you know, he's he's an icon in music and no disrespect to the boss, but, you know, stick to music, man. <laughs> That's all I got to say on that one. I think that was probably the commercial that probably made some people talk. Well, we know the media was talking about it because, because some media, some of the media was criticizing it. Others were going, yeah, okay, but all in all, it wasn't all that great of a commercial. Um, like I said, we haven't had that It commercial from the Super Bowl. Um, they tried to attempt at humor, hit and miss on the humor. Um, so, you know, I don't know why they're not writing those great commercials that they used to. So, it is what it is. Um, what else can we talk about? Oh, yes. The Super Bowl halftime show. Snore. Boring. It looked like an over-budgeted MTV music video. That's what I thought of it. I, I wasn't too thrilled with it. It was just like a, like I said, a big MTV video. That's all it was. It was boring. I really, I watched a little bit of it and just kind of went, wasn't thrilled, didn't do nothing for me. Pepsi, you need to find better quality talent. I'm just saying. Because in about five years, we're never going to hear from this guy ever again. He's like a one hit wonder, maybe two hit wonder. Maybe three hit wonder, but let, let, but in about five years, he's going to probably dis disappear from the music scene or something. I don't know. But all I know, that halftime show, pretty boring. Yeah. Like I said, it was an over-budgeted MTV music video. But what the hell do I know? I'm just a guy in a basement so there you go. Until next time, everyone, I will see you. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button down there somewhere. Or leave a comment. How do you feel about the Super Bowl commercials or the Super Bowl halftime show? I'd like to hear from you. I'd like to see what you want to say about it. So let your fingers do the walking. Until next time, I am the Drunk Farmer, and I will see you when I see you. So long.